It was my mission that day to start the process of elevating my FPV status to mediocre. I knew in order to do this that I must go through many batteries and long hours of practice. But since I already have hours upon hours of photography drone experience, I thought, why not throw it right into Acro immediately? <laughs> That's why. Being attacked by one's own tiny whoop drone is a sobering moment for anyone who thinks they can transition right away from photography drone pilot right over to FPV pilot. And so with my tail between my legs, I went back to stabilized mode just for a moment to get my legs. Of course, stabilized mode will prevent you from flipping. You can't flip the thing when it's in this mode. So it's a lot easier to fly and not cr Okay. I only brought six batteries with me. So that means I had about 45, 50 minutes of practice time. And once I got the hang of it, I mean, it was like riding a... All right then. This little beta FPV tiny whoop is a durable thing. And once I was in the air, once I got the feel for those sticks, I was zooming around the field. I was zooming around me. I was going through the uprights. I mean, nothing could stop me. Except the constant pull of gravity and my inexperience at FPV. As frustrating as this was, I was not going to give up. So I got back in the air and I decided to throw it into acro mode for the first time. And then I decided to throw it into acro mode for the second time. The third time. The fourth time. The last time. So this is what you have to do. Every time I see one of those guys like Mr. Steel or Johnny FPV flying up and down the buildings, I really want to be able to do that. So that's what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to get a feel for this. And I think using this tiny whoop is probably the best way for me because I don't need no stinking simulator. I mean, who needs it? I probably need a simulator. I do want to thank Jerry Calverly from Mesquite, Texas. He is a teacher who teaches a drone class, the Drone Interest Group at John Horn High School in Texas. And if it weren't for him, I wouldn't even be flying today because he walked me through this beta flight program that every FPV pilot knows about, and it's quite the learning curve. So just know if you're going to get into FPV, as fun as it looks, there's a lot of unfun things that you need to learn before you can get in the air. It sets up all the parameters from your drone and your controller. They have to get integrated together and the controller is a whole other story. The interface and software inside the Tyrannus FR Sky controller is not very user friendly. So I have to tip my hat to the FPV flyers. They are absolutely the most skilled drone pilots in the industry. Luckily for me, this little tiny whoop is pretty durable and can take many crashes. Although it does come with some replacement propellers, I did crack the housing, but that's no big deal. You can order some online. In fact, I have a link to this drone and accessories in the description below. Acro sucks, or is hard. Doesn't suck, it, it's difficult. Mm. Well, I'd stay longer, but it's starting to rain. And I'm just about out of batteries. Just a quick video today showing you the first time I tried Acro. It was frustrating to say the least. By the way, this entire video was shot on the DJI Osmo action camera. Even the sound is directly from the camera. And if you would like to win something really cool right now, if you're a beginner, if you're just getting into drones, you can win this. This is the H823H from Snaptane. And it's so easy that even someone with no experience can fly it. Person with no experience? This is Brandy. She's gonna fly this for the first time with no practice, aren't you? Yes. Ah, magic. That is the uh, little snap chain. Now this isn't an FPV drone. It's just a little non-GPS toy, but it's a great little beginner drone. You're a beginner, right? Yes. Okay. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, she's a pro. She's got this. She's got this. Yeah, you got it. Good. All right. How, oh. Well. Oh. Oh. 
if you would like to win this really fun drone, all you have to do is uh, put this word in the comments. That exact word. And I will choose from those who commented. Did you get this out of my hair now? It's stuck in her hair. Thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. <laughs> Bo and bye. What's wrong, Brady? It's my hair. You got a drone stuck in your hair, do you? <laughs> oh, you are in there. I'm gonna yes. have to. I'm gonna have to cut. <laughs> oh, no, you can't go in here. I have to. It's all knotted. Look at that. Zippity dip, dippity dip. You're free. Look what you did. <laughs> <laughs> I think I just peed a little. <laughs>